Hey guys, what's up? This is Karan here back with a new video and you're welcome to Tech Karan YouTube channel. I've installed CoreTOS latest version CoreTOS 5.9 which is based on Android 10 and is available for Redmi Note 8 and almost all the devices. We got the security patch of 5th of April 2020. What are the things? What are the features of CoreTOS custom room? Is Google camera working or not? And what about the Geekpen score? Everything in this video so make sure you watch this video till the end. Let's get started now. Okay, so I will start as always with the home scene as always and the launcher which you get here by default is the launcher. This is not the third party launcher which I have installed, you get the by default launcher launcher which has lots of customization options which is the alternative of pixel launcher, you get lots of options to customize your device. If you have ever used launcher, you will surely love this launcher and you get the swipe down gesture all, uh, already available. But you can also edit a lot of tiles here, hold and drag to add tiles here like FPS info, data saver, dark theme, night light and a lot more. When you click here and also get the option of setting the columns, columns, landscape, quick bar, rows and you can also these kind of things you can edit from here. Let's move forward, let's check out the camera first of all, you get the by default camera available is the ANX camera which has AI mode already enabled and also have the option of portrait mode but unfortunately you don't get 48 megapixel camera installed here, you have to sacrifice your 48 megapixel camera but yes if you wanna install there is a magisk module available for that which you can try out if you want to, I have not tried that so I cannot show you about that, I am not sure regarding that. If we talk about Gcam, I'm using Gcam 7.3 which is very very good and perfectly working. It has lots of options but the thing is HDR is not working. If I use HDR plus it is not working at all. It is showing like these kind of pink pinkish things. So unfortunately HDR plus is not working. You have to disable HDR mode for proper functioning of Gcam. Otherwise camera mode, portrait mode, video mode and a lot more things are properly working and let's talk about some other things you got the code papers app pre-installed it means you have a lot of wallpapers pre-installed which you can add or remove from here like these are the extra wallpapers available whichever you want to choose whichever you like you can choose that on your home screen and lock screen and if we talk about Geekbench score, I am using this room and this is almost same performance like the stock room, almost same, wait let me just show you, it is again force stopped, if it is force stop, you have to force close it once and then open this app once again. Now. If we talk about the Geekbench score, the Geekbench score is totally almost same like the stock ROM. So it it feels like you are using a stock ROM like 308 is the average Geekbench score of single core and in this ROM you get 311. Little bit of improvement here and in multi core also only a little bit of improvement. So almost same type of performance like the stock ROM. So it is almost like stock ROM and but the performance and smoothness is very very good. I didn't got any lag till now using from some hours but not a single lag also the battery backup is very much great and almost smooth. If we talk about Magisk Manager, Magisk is properly working and if safety neck check is passed or not, yes it is also passed, CTS profile is true and basic integrity is also true. Let's move on to settings and let me show you some features of Colt OS Custom Room. Network and internet connected devices, apps and notifications, all extra things are almost same. In battery, you have the option of smart charging. You can enable this option from settings. If we talk about display, you have some extra features of screen attention and auto rotate options and all other things like you can choose fonts. There are a lot of fonts options available. So whichever font you like, you can choose that one directly from here. Also without root if you want to try out. Status bar icons are available and a lot more things. Sound, storage, privacy, location, everything is available. In security, you have the option of fingerprint and pattern. And both things are working perfectly. In my case, face lock is not available. You have to sacrifice the face lock and all other things are almost same. 
सो कोल्ट एनिजमा इज द कस्टमाइजेशन टैप फ्रॉम कोल्ट ओ एस रोम ऑलवेज यू गेट सम स्टेटस फॉर कस्टमाइजेशन लाइक नेटवर्क ट्रैफिक एंड वोल्टी आइकन एट्सट्रा इन कैरियर लेवल यू कैन सेट द कैरियर लेवल टू स्टेटस बार इफ यू वॉन्ट ट्राई आउट क्लॉक सेटिंग्स ऑब्वियसली यू कैन कस्टमाइज योर क्लॉक सेटिंग्स ऑन द स्टेटस बार टू बैटरी स्टाइल यू कैन चूज द बैटरी स्टाइल टू क्विक सेटिंग बैटरी स्टाइल यू कैन चेंज एंड स्टेटस बार बैटरी स्टाइल बोथ यू कैन चेंज फ्रॉम हेयर यू ऑल्सो गेट सम ऑप्शन ऑफ एग्रेसिव बैटरी वेर यू कैन ऑटो इनेबल द एग्रेसिव बैटरी ऑप्शन फ्रॉम हेयर एंड ऑल्सो गेट द बैटरी चार्ज वार्निंग एंड वेन इट वेन इट रीच इज दैट लेवल विच यू सेट हेयर यू विल गेट अ वार्निंग ऑफ बैटरी चार्जिंग दैट्स अ वेरी वेरी गुड फीचर एंड एट लास्ट यू कैन कस्टमाइज योर क्विक सेटिंग लाइक क्विक पुल डाउन एट स्मार्ट पुल डाउन यू कैन ऑल्सो सेट द फूटर टेक्स एंड ऑल अदर काइंड ऑफ थिंग्स यू हैव द ऑप्शन ऑफ वन मेन थिंग लेट मी शो यू ब्लर बिहाइंड क्विक सेटिंग इफ यू चूज दिस यू विल सी देर इज अ ब्लर हेयर विच यू कैन इनेबल और डिसेबल फ्रॉम हेयर In buttons, you have the option of like volume rockers. You can choose the volume buttons behavior from here, and you can also choose the navigation bar options. But I am not using navigation bar as you can see. I'm using full screen gestures that are working perfectly. Power menu is the normal customization menu for all the rooms. Add in gestures, and when we talk about A O S P gesture here, you have the very very one of the favorite my options like full screen gestures. You can hide the pill from here and use that one easily. and here you can also choose the amount of screen height used as a touchable region so all these features are one of my favorite the performance is super super great and seriously this room is one of the best rooms i have ever used yes there are some lot more best rooms available if you compare them with that but yes colt os this update is one of the best update of colt os previous build had some bugs and was not good for that much uh, was not good for daily usage but this one is just awesome in lock screen you have the option to customize the lock screen if we talk about here here you have the option to customize your notifications which you can choose like this and this is a show notification headers you have the option of android 11 you can choose the notification header your notifications will be categorized like silent notifications and conversations and these are the very very good things which you only get in android 11 as of now there are a lot of options available and at last you have the option of animations and you have the option of themes etc screen customizations and at last miscellaneous where you get the gaming mode etc nothing else so these were kind of options these are the only features and everything about the cold os custom room i hope you like this build so this was all thanks for watching have a nice day